Hi guys, Deb here with Art and Grace. Thank you for waiting on me. I'm a little late and as you can see, I'm a little worse for wear. <laughs> I literally am burning up hot. So here we are doing Christmas in July. And if you're watching the replay, then you're gonna hear this part and it's pretty hilarious. But just, just fast forward. But we're doing Christmas in July today. I'm excited to show you how easy ceramics are to paint. I've got a little tree. Um, I'm going to show you the larger size tree, but for today I'll paint this small one and it will be quick and easy. Uh, the larger ones are easy as well, but they do take a little bit longer. So I thought, why don't we just do a small one? Hello guys, come on in. I'm sorry that I'm late. I think I had a hot flash and I don't mind telling y'all that. <laughs> I am so hot. Texas is so hot. I can hardly stand it. And the room that I'm in is that we've got a big window. It is a hundred degrees in here and I'm not kidding. So bear with me. Um, hairs up. I'm not dressed for Christmas. I had all these grand ideas, but it's so hot. I can't take it. Hello, Cheryl. How are you? Hi, Jean. I'm so glad y'all are here. Hi, Bricky. Hello, Christy and Laura. We're gonna start off the bat with some happy mail. Hello, Faye, how are you today? Hi, Rhonda and Anna. I'm glad y'all are here. Hi, Marty, hi, Shelly. I always call you Shelly Ann because um, I don't know, I just like saying Shelly Ann. Does anybody, oh, almost dropped my pretty jar. This is my little sunflower jar and I just almost knocked it over. I'm gonna write down the first person. We have got to do that giveaway. That's Oh, that's for July, so you're the first person for July. So let me see. On my end, the first person was Shelly Ann Baker. So let me write this down. And today is Friday. Shelly Ann Baker. Okay. So at the end of the month, we draw one name from everybody who showed up first. So it's kind of a, a little race to get here when I go live. And of course, my fault, I was a little late today. But Shelly Ann, you are on the money and you are here, or at least the one first one I see. So, hi Mary, I'm glad you're a first time viewer. Welcome, hi Monica. Who else do we have? Hi Nancy, hi Sherry. We had so much fun painting last night, guys. Hi Amber, glad you're here. Hi Tammy, thank you for spreading the grace. Yes, if you guys will sprinkle this out, that would be great and we will get, oh yes, Christy, they're so bad. We will get, um, get this spread out so more people can see. Thank you, Trisha. And guys, keep on commenting. I know I'm not going to see every comment, but I do go back and read them all and reply. And you are welcome to message me anytime if I don't see your comment and you want to ask a question or anything. Hi, Rula. So glad you're here. Hi, Kristen. Um, part of my funnest thing is to just go through and see who's here because I keep saying it's like having friends at your house and you're like, come on in, come on in. I want everybody here. We'll all just gather around and have fun. Yes, I'm hot. I look a mess because I'm so hot, but that's okay. I'm amongst friends and I know y'all don't really care. You want to see how this is done. Now, like I said, the ceramics that I am ordering right now, the trees are larger and I'm going to show you one in a second, but um, this is a mini version that we're going to paint so that it will go quick and easy. Hello, Linda Con. Hi, Missy. I'm guessing it's Missy. Hello, Anna and Deborah Parrott. Happy 4th of July weekend, guys. I would love to hear what you guys are doing. Okay, let me kind of get started and I'll come back and look at comments, so don't worry. Oh, I forgot my alarm. So I saw earlier on somebody else's live, it was Tracy Campbell. She had a little alarm sitting on her desk and she would set it. And of course, nobody knew how long she set it for. And it would go off every so often and she would draw a happy meal. So that's what I'm going to do. But I'll just go, okay, surprise, and click my, you know, stop my finger on the next, or whoever's the next comment that I see. So you will have already made the comment. So anyway, Amber, I order these from a wholesaler when they go on sale. Their ceramics can be expensive. These are really well made. I order them from the same supplier every time. I've tried two different ones and these are my favorites, so I just stick with them. And um, so no, I didn't, I don't know if you can, I'm sure you can buy these other places like Hobby Lobby or something. I have just honestly never looked. Um, but anyway, so when you get this out of the package, take either a little cloth, a clean cloth, or like a brush that's clean, 
and you're gonna get off all the dust that settles. Am I talking loud? I feel like I'm yelling. I'm so used to talking loud so that y'all can hear me that I keep forgetting I've got this mic on now. So tell me how the sound is. Let me know. Um, ceramic can be, yeah, they are expensive. Yes, Linda, that's the awesome thing. These are called ceramic bisque. So they have been fired once and typically people paint them and then fire them again but you don't have to and people didn't know that and a lot of people still don't realize that but in this stage you can paint them and then you don't have to fire them again now they won't be as glazed looking as a true ceramic that's been glazed twice hi mary hi rhonda yeah they are expensive thank you anna it makes me feel good when i'm you know like stressed and rushing and I'm hot and I look a mess and then to hear your sweet comments I'm like oh thank you it just makes me want to hug you thank you I know the people who watch me don't mind I get it I know um, because I never mind when people say that and I'm watching them I'm like girl we don't care what you look like or you know like red faced it's okay um okay so we've got it all kind of cleaned off and it's ready to paint you don't have here's another cool thing you don't have to base coat these you can just go in there and start painting um i've got y'all pulled up on my ipad it might be a little easier for me to see so if you see me kind of looking down that's why i've got my ipad pulled up here Ooh, a nativity scene um you know we can order those so if you guys enjoy doing ceramics i'll keep my eyes peeled for sales i don't buy these unless they're on sale because I can't I can't charge y'all a whole lot of money because I won't pay it and I know they say don't worry about it you know I just will not buy these till they're on sale um, because some people sell these for so much and it just you know if you just wait to the right time so if you want ceramics if you want a ceramic tree and you you know after you watch this today and you're like yeah I want to do it then now's the time to get it they're on sale for until the 5th so July 5th is the last day and I've got a link in the comment or in the description of the video and all that so all we're gonna do guys is come in here and paint this thing together and then I will show you some tips and tricks and um, what I use I'll put some snow on this one and all kind of stuff yeah you didn't know you didn't know that and I used yes my grandmother did the traditional way and so that's all I knew about until a few years ago oh Anna you're so sweet I love my friend I mean I love you guys I care <laughs> I do I uh, of course I do I'm a small enough page that you know I know you guys I think when you get bigger which is great because Facebook will pay you you know they they help creators that get big but I don't ever want to get so big that I don't know y'all um, it's important to me to know my friends my you know people that show up for me um, okay Monica says you've got a seller that's reasonable most people get the eight or the 13 inch which is I'll sh well it's just hard and cumbersome to move but this is an 11 so let me just do it hold on guys hold on you know my desk is small so I've got things kind of pushed over here I don't have the lights in it yet but do you see this so this is the 13 inch and this is the one that I am ordering now and this is the 11 inch so there's quite a bit of difference this to me is perfect for um, a smaller kitchen counter like if you're in an apartment or an assisted living or a table side maybe you have a little entry table or a bathroom counter this is much more of a statement piece and it's got a nice big base so that this is my favorite size I do have a mambo if y'all want to see it I'll show it to you at the end it's huge okay so what you first thing decide what color you want your base so you guys pick I will paint this however y'all want do you want a red base or a gold base or you guys tell me thank you Jessica this is one of the few things that I have gotten from Bell Lily that I love 
Um, most of the things that I've ordered from there have been far too small and even an extra large is small so you are Anna oh my goodness they're gonna love that um, I just love I love love ceramics oh that's fun Jeannie that would be a lot of fun okay yes a tray that would be pretty Mary now these um, you know you're gonna have a light kit and it'll need to plug in so remember that and that's why I say on counters is really good or a little table red okay we got gold oh go let's see oh I'm gonna have to really think about this we got red gold red gold 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 red gold so far ooh coastal so far gold is winning hi Barb I'm glad you're new welcome I'm Deb I'm in Texas come on in I had planned to dress uh, Christmassy today and have it all no it's just too hot we're gonna do gold I think I saw a lot more golds but yes red oh actually guys maybe I should do red because this one's gold I think I'm gonna do red hi Jessica oh, oh I don't know it's, it's so split okay the next comment that I see when I look down at my iPad I will choose that one and it is it says Tana welcome Tana said welcome gold or red I know it'll be pretty <laughs> okay the next one that says a color <laughs> oh, thank you Shelly for welcoming Barb I love that gold okay Shelly we're doing gold it's okay either one is gonna be gorgeous so I love using the metallics you guys know if you follow me you know that I love the deco art metallics I love the products so much that I wrote them asking to be an affiliate so it's not like they came looking for me I said this is all I use I love it I have tried everything and this is my favorite so I would like to be an affiliate so yes they let me so I say that so that you know I don't you can use whatever you want it doesn't matter to me one bit but you'll see me use deco art and the people who watch me regularly know that that's my favorite so I think it has excellent coverage um, good quality but you will use whatever acrylic paint you like I will say that I would not use cheap acrylic paint on a nice ceramic tree if you're gonna pay for a ceramic tree I would use the highest quality paint you know that you can buy and I don't mean go get some luxurious brand I just mean I would not get Dollar Tree acrylic paint for a ceramic tree or even um, a, maybe I've used um, Apple Barrel before but it is a little more runny I, I would not use it for this so that's just my advice on quality does matter on nicer things like this so I would go ahead and invest in a dollar fifty bottle of deco art and if you get it on sale you can get it for a dollar fifteen at Michaels so just watch for those sales let's see yes great wax yes Jeannie I know you do don't you I have a lot of friends that use it and I just I feel bad because I, I don't care what anybody uses it doesn't matter to me but um, you know I don't want people to think I'm only pushing it to get a commission because I never remember to use my code so I'm not getting anything really because I never ever think to use it so I do go ahead and um, I like to paint the bottoms if I'm gonna give this away which I will in fact should I give this to one of you guys that would be fun I hadn't even thought of that but why not so we'll give this away at the end of the night um, I'll just go ahead and paint the bottom and make it really nice so that you know when somebody gets it it's complete and finished and looks great and these kits come as complete set so it this one is the smaller one so I'm not ordering these I don't I don't really order these right now but I'm doing the 13 inch only right now and um, uh, what was I gonna say oh and it comes with a separate base so this is all one piece as you can see and your cord comes out the bottom right here and then let me set my brush down this 13 inch one that I'm going to order a bunch of 
has the separate base. So this is a nice large base with the light kit here. And then you just set your tree down on top of it. So it gives off a lot more light. And, um, and I say I'm not ordering these. Um, I might order some if somebody really, really wants one. These are just so much better for just a tiny bit more money that all of the times I've ordered for people, they always choose this or the large. I rarely have anybody choose the small one. So I guess it's not to say I can't order it. I just haven't planned on it, to be honest. So, okay, let me catch up a little bit while this is kind of drying for a second. These dry really fast. You like the metallic gold? I do too, thank you. The light sticks, yes, you put the little, they come with the lights. It'll come in a little package and it will give you the lights and the little topper. And of course you can all, oh, Linda, you didn't keep your mama's. Oh. Hi, April, how are you today? Maddie was like, you can't go live like that. Look at how red you are. I'm like, I, listen, this is, anybody over 50 that has hot flashes, this, uh, it's gonna be a while before it <laughs> goes away. So it is what it is. Did she text you and go, oh gosh, go look at my mom. Um, I don't know what I was saying. I got my train of thought messed up. Neutral. Oh, Mindy. Oh, yeah. That would be gorgeous. And you can. Oh, I think I know what I was going to say. You can order the bulbs in a solid color. So if you wanted to do a, I think I might even do that, Mindy. If you want to do a beach themed tree, you could order the blue lights or clear lights, you know, so you can order all of one. Did I make you one April last year? Because I was going to do you a white and gold one. I can't remember if I did. Robin, thank you for sprinkling. So, Linda, I was going to tell you, I'm so sorry you didn't keep that tree. Because I did keep my mom's. And she made one for me, one for my brother, and one for my mom, mom and dad. And, um, actually, I probably, I was going to say, I probably shouldn't even do two coats since you guys are watching. But, I'll go ahead. This really isn't going to take that much time. I always feel like I need to hurry for you guys. But y'all probably aren't in as big of a hurry as I feel all the time. I always feel like, hurry, let them go. They need to go do other things. And So I need to, I want to do this really well so I can give this away. Um, anyway, I treasure those trees. And every time we move, I just hold my breath, you know, like, please don't break. And, you know, as long as you store them well, they'll last forever. That's the only issue is that these trees are fragile. Ceramics are fragile. So you do need to wrap them well with bubble wrap um, or something like that. You know, you could use a lot of paper. Thank you for saying that, Patty. I appreciate you. Um, Tammy, um, okay, so they're 55 for this size. 55 for this large size 13 inch is what it is i want to see if that's from the base or the, just the tree i should have yeah 13 inch tall um these i will have to check i haven't checked the price i didn't even check it for this because they're small and usually people don't want them but they've been running about 45 so it's like for 10 more dollars you get such a better tree but i can look at the price if you're interested Oh, wow, five. That's awesome, Karen. I'm so glad y'all have them. They're so special. Yes. Oh, Wanda. Hi, Dan. Oh, that's so cool. It has a music box. Glad you're here, girl. I am so glad you guys came. I didn't know if anybody would be interested in doing Christmas yet, but we're doing, I'm going to do every Friday one Christmas in July item. So, okay, let's start moving on to the green. And I know I'm missing comments. It's killing me. I'm trying to look, but it's so hard. Thank you for the stars, Barb. Thank you, thank you. Hi, Cindy. 51 years old. Let me think. Okay, so my grandmother made us one. It was late 70s, right? Yeah, late 70s. Your sister has your mom's. Oh, that's awesome. Okay, so I usually get out two green colors. And I just kind of vary my greens. This is Hauser Medium Green. 
and then I've got festive green which I love every year I use festive green a lot but there's the difference in the two just if you don't have two just use the one and add a little bit I'll just show you real fast because a lot of people do not know how to blend if you're new to painting this won't take two seconds for me to show you and then you know and you don't you know because if you don't know you don't know Christy, thank you for the stars. Y'all are so nice. I appreciate y'all. I don't know. I, I don't know if Facebook says something to you or if y'all just do it, but it always cracks me up because I'm like, wait to see if you like what I'm doing. Yeah, aren't they pretty? This one is like the perfect Christmas green. And then I just like some variety. So, Oh, Jeannie, where do you store them? I wish I had good storage. White and gold, I know, April. $30 for 13 inches. Linda, you're going to take away my business. That's crazy. Now, is sh what's shipping on that? That is crazy. Wow. Well, I guess I'll let y'all go. Y'all have a good day. Thank you for watching. <laughs> I'm not really sure what to say after that. <laughs> okay. Um, okay, so I'm going to take my green and pull some over here and add a little bit of white to it and just kind of see what I get. We're going to get a light green, obviously. Nancy, thank you for the stars. <gasps> Hi, Mary. Oh, I'm so glad you're here. I am Linda I sure am I sell a lot of things that I make okay so now you see you've got a different shade of green so you've got you've obviously got the one that came right out of the bottle and then we've now got this lighter green and then if I want three shades of green I'm just gonna put a little bit of black oh Cindy thank you I appreciate that amber that's sweet oh Mary I have a friend that has a whole collection and she has them on an entry table and more she's got a lot they are so pretty set up like that like she has them all lit up and so gorgeous we're having a stars party well thank you guys for the stars I don't see anything on either device and then I take just the littlest bit of black it really doesn't take much for you to kind of you know really get that dark so start with a little and if it's not enough you can add more okay so let me move this over here so you can see it better aside this is the one out of the bottle we're going to add just another dot and get it pretty dark so that way you've got three different shades of green to work with so you've got the one out of the bottle the dark one and the light one so you really don't have to buy multiple shades of green if you don't want to but when they're a buck I go ahead and stock up so thank you Amber I got this at Belle Lily if you go to my website um, there's a page that says my favorite supplies and I've got a link on there to Belle Lily or you can just google it but that's where I got it by large because they are small wow wait Catherine what did you say you have at least 40 different sizes what wow Mary, thank you. Okay, I better get to painting. Y'all are going to leave me. Thank you, thank you, guys. Y'all are the best. Okay, so just get a chip brush. This is $1 at the Dollar Tree, or I usually try to pick these up at Michael's and just use, you know, when they, they have a 20% off coupon all the time. Hello, Deborah. How are you today? Thank you, Barb. It is really cute. This is the second one I've ordered. I forget what the other one looks like. I mean, it's this kind of type of pattern with the sleeve. Oh, it's cowboy looking. And I do really like this one. So, um, can be a, just a cheap chip brush. You could have used it on other things, but as long as it's clean and everything, you're good. I'll just kind of do this to be sure no loose. You know, the Dollar Tree ones, they will come out pretty easily. And if you, I, these I get at Michael's and they don't come out. So that's why I usually like to get them there. Yes, Ashley, hi. I didn't even know you were here. How many do you have? that is so funny that you caught on because yes I was talking about your beautiful trees on your entry table so start at the bottom and you're gonna just kind of get up under here with your brush you can use a smaller brush for this part but I always just go for it you know because I've done it a while but if you feel better with a smaller brush 
go by all means use a smaller brush right there when you're bucking up to your gold but this is just the bottom of the branches so just need to get that painted as well I can't believe I didn't even put an apron on y'all I'm brave oh oh my goodness can y'all see y'all have to holler at me if I get off the camera view Are you talking about store the trees? Ashley, I have one big daddy. I have one and it's sitting down here. I'll show it to you. Um, I love the big one. I don't have room for it in our house. Our house is small. We do not have room for that. So I'm going to kind of come on up now and do the underside of all of these. This is just when I said I'm telling you my tips and tricks. This is one of them and this makes it go faster. Gosh, I need to really figure out. Can y'all see well? Maybe like this. Okay, that's better. Well, I get paint. I do get paint on me. When I'm wearing just old t-shirts, I don't care. I mean, I don't mind getting paint on me, so I'm not as careful. But today, I am going to be a little careful because I do like this blouse and I don't want to get paint on it. Yes, Home Depot, Walmart, Dollar Tree, Michaels. I use Dollar Tree ones sometimes. I just, they're not my favorite because the bristles do tend to come out a lot easier. Oh, Ashley's Pyrex dish collection is amazing. If y'all ever want to see it, I'm sure she would let me post a picture on my page of it. Um, beautiful colored, all different colors. I need to make you a new wreath, by the way. I want you to have a new one. I know you just keep using it, but you need a new Deb wreath. And if you notice, I'm holding this because it's already dry. So acrylic paint dries pretty quick on ceramics. Hi, Vanessa. How are you? Oh, Patty. Funny, I think a lot of husbands do that. Especially if it's sports but sometimes my husband my husband really likes music so every now and then he'll watch some kind of clip of a concert or something and I'm just like turn it down I hate that okay so I've just done all the bottom of each of these little branches now that makes it just go quicker and easier because we know that part's done okay Oh, I would love to have, um, I'd love to have a collection, maybe someday, if we ever have more space, but gosh, I just don't know. Um, oh, yeah, you should, Jeanette, you might can get a better deal being, you know, walk in and take it with you. Um, Sue, I have a link up in the description of this video where you can get, you know, you can order from me. If you want to, um, somebody did in here in the comments say that she saw one for 30 on Etsy. I don't know how much shipping is, so don't feel bad if you need to do that. <laughs> That's a, a an amazing price. I just I'd have to look at it and see what you know what the quality is and and all that. But yeah, that's crazy, and I don't begrudge anybody doing that. <laughs> I don't think I'll miss any meals. Yes, you need a new debris. Um, okay, sorry if I ended if I missed anybody asking a question. Okay, and now I am going at least you're getting to see how to paint it. So I'm gonna still take my same color paint and just kind of keep on going. We will add in our other color on top, but I'm just gonna now just kind of go around and get for the most part get this painted. If there are parts that are not covered, that's okay because we're going to use that other color as well. So, you know, it's not a big deal. If you're seeing any white spots, we're going to use both colors. And so there's no problem. Now, one thing that is a little trick is you can get some of those clean spoolies. I didn't order any because I just don't care that much to order them. Um, but if you want to order those spoolies that are clean you know you can get them I think they sell them in 
I know I've seen them on Amazon in big packs, but I just, I use a brush. I'll just find an older brush. And anyway, if you take the spoolie, you can kind of get paint down into that little hole. I just will take one of my smaller round brushes because I have so many brushes. And I'll use that to get down in there. But um, anyway, that's an option too. Thank you. Shipping on Etsy was about 50. Okay, so 55 for me and you got it from me and helped a small business. <laughs> I'm teasing, you You do what you need to do. Um, if you are in the VIP group, which is my monthly membership, then your price is 50. So you do get a $5 discount just for being in my membership group. So for you, you would need to go into the VIP group because I've already got it in there, the link's in there, um, and order yours inside that group. But everybody else, um, I'm selling them at a, at a good, good price. I can't discount everybody's uh, more than that. And you'll see, you'll see some more getting sold closer to Christmas and they'll be expensive. It's hard, shipping is so costly that um, unless people are ordering a whole bunch or maybe lucked into somebody going out of business and selling them, because um, I don't market my price as much, I promise. <laughs> and if you have a business, you know, because you buy them too, probably. Okay, we're getting there, guys. That's why I did the smaller one to show you, because it can get probably boring to watch. Let's see. How much do you sell them for, Barb? They're 55 for the 13 inch. Let me show it to you. This is the 13 inch and it's got a separate base and it comes with the light kit and it comes with the little pegs or the lights and a little star for the top. We're just doing this smaller one today to show you the technique and how to do it. But um, I am ordering the 13 inch size. This size, the 11 inch, is very, very close in price. So um, for just a few more dollars, I say get the larger one, but I can check on the price and see what it is for anybody who might just want the smaller one. Okay. Oh, I love these trees. I love them. Do you, Catherine? Well, you could sell them because especially if they're vintage, people really love that. Bye, Tracy. Thank you for coming. Yeah, I'll show you, Catherine. <laughs> yes, let's do, Ashley. Tell me when. I'll be there, girl. I miss you. Okay, I'm coming right in. I'm not cleaning my brush, and I'm coming right into this Kelly Green kind of color and going to start putting this on. And I am taking my brush and kind of working it down, you know, kind of going in downward motions. But we're going to get it all covered. And uh, some of the other green will show. You can, when, when you're doing the larger tree, you're going to want to put down like a blanket or a, uh, not blanket, but an old towel or something on your table. So that if it slips out of your hand, because see how you kind of hold it and move it around. So that if it slips out, you won't break it since they're so fragile. I don't recommend, I really don't recommend kids doing these unless you're okay with it possibly getting broken just because, you know, they're, they're easy to break. But if you're brave and you have a very mature young person, then go for it. I, I've always thought it would be really fun to have you know, um, everybody paint one. I order ornaments though at Christmas time and that is a really good family project. So you can all paint your own ornament and that's a lot of fun. Got your mama, we love to, yes. Oh, you've got your mom's? Yeah. Well, they do make great gifts. Um, and I definitely love these for anybody who's in a small space. So if you're in an apartment or a small home like we are, or uh, assisted living, you know, any of those situations, dorm, 
um, they would be just fantastic. You know, putting up a tree for elderly people is too much. You know what I mean? It's a lot. So all they have to do is take it out of the box, put in the little pegs, plug it in, and you are good to go. So I'm just working my way down. I know it looks like I'm covering up that under green, the first green we did, but um, you can you can cover it if you want to, or you can, you know, like it's personal preference on the color, to be honest. I like a lot of this Kelly green for this one since I have one. Well, I am giving this away though, I just realized. I was thinking, I think since this one's a little darker, I'm gonna do this one a little lighter, but. I can go back if you if I need to. Happiness, right? They are. They make me happy too. I paint a lot of ceramics. So I do um, the camper. I did a little camper last year that is Buffalo Check. It's super cute. Um, I do. I've done a, um, what do you call? Gingerbread house. I've done a lot of different things. You do, Linda. Well, this would be perfect for you. I mean, really, because putting up a big tree is a hassle. Thank you, Nelda, for sprinkling. But I know what you mean about having a tree. Ten trees? Mary, I love that. We had a two-story house when the kids were young, and I definitely put up, um, I put up, let me think if I had one. Yeah, each child had one, but it was more like this size, um, you know, the 13 inch or so, maybe about 15 inch, and it was a, a, you know, a fake tree. And then we had one in the living room, and I think I had one at the top of the stairs. So we had a lot more trees then, but we do two now. We do one in the front room because it shows from the street, and then one in the living room. I think I'm going to come back through here and add a little more of that darker green back in, but it's all just personal preference on the color. Ooh, Patty, your RV, that'll be awesome. Yeah. Perfect size, perfect size for an RV. What a great idea. And you know, that's a that's a great point because um, you know people that have everything and you don't know what to get them at Christmas think about their home and and maybe that their lifestyle would they could they use you know a uh, a tree that'd be a great idea to get for somebody that travels I am getting green on my base so I'm gonna have to go back and repaint that a little bit put on another coat but it's because I'm talking and not paying attention as much which I do when I go live I'm all into the chit chatting with you guys and yeah for a room or a bathroom mm -hmm. yeah perfect so so far we've done this whole thing with just your chip brush just a regular old chip brush because you're just getting the color on there and then when you when it gets to the point where you want to put some uh, either glitter or uh, snow then you'll move to a smaller brush oh we got to pick a happy meal I, I can't even believe I hadn't done this okay so I'm gonna next comment so right now I have Catherine Rohde says go to Deb's link so the next comment that pops up will get happy mail from me April Tilligan <laughs> You got happy mail. Okay, I'm going to do the next one, which is Mary White. So Mary White and April, you get happy mail. April is like my little daughter-in-law. I'm not going to, uh, that's too crazy that she won. So I'll give you April, I'll give you happy mail. But also, <laughs> uh, Mary White. So Mary, send me your address. And y'all, I'm sorry that I'm just now thinking of that. Because I have a lot I want to give away. I'm going to give away some for people that sprinkle this out. So um, I know that some of you, you know, send it however to your group or to friends, and that's great. But the way that I do it, I'll go at the end of the video, it'll show me who sprinkled, 
if it's public. So when you sprinkle it to like your page or something, oh, April, I'll give you some too. Um, when you sprinkle it just, I guess, to your page, it's public. And that's how I can tell that Facebook lets me know that you did. So I, rather than taking the time to go see who did and who didn't and, and oh, I can't see it, maybe they didn't, I, that's how I do it. So if you sprinkle publicly afterwards, I'll grab three of those names and send three of you Happy Meal. So what I'll do is I'll send you a message or I might just come, I'll probably comment on your, you know, when you share it. I'll comment and say, hey, send me your address. So be watching after this. I'll do that right away. I used to message people, but they would not see the message because if you're not Facebook friends, you know how the message just sits in that weird place until you answer it. Oh, you did, Linda. I wanted to try to make you smile because you've had such a rough time. Yes, Karen, I got it at Bell Lily. Bell Lily. A lot of us use them, and I've really I need to return some things. You really have to order up. Their sizing is not correct. Um, I am a large person. However, even extra large in some things is too small. So that's that shouldn't be. I should. I mean, I should be able to wear an extra extra large. Right, April. <laughs> I'm not really that big. But anyway, you have to definitely size up. Okay, now I'm gonna come in here with a smaller brush and get, thank you for sprinkling, Patty. Aw. Hey, Jessica, how do we make it? Are you talking about the tree? Because you just order the tree from me and then paint it. Oh, Amber, I mean, I've gained a lot of weight the last two years, like many of us, you know this oh thank y'all for sprinkling i appreciate it this is one of my older brushes and you know it's not going to ruin it to do this but i would not use one of my very nice new brushes to do this because i'm going to kind of dig around inside here oh brooke i love you you're my friend yeah okay good karen i'm glad i'm not the only one but yeah their sizing is off so i i get so disappointed because you know i'll think oh that's going to be so cute and i'll tell you just while we're on the subject i ordered a dress and it's just so cheaply made i was so disappointed so i don't know how much i want to risk it with them um but you know i'll probably risk it again because they are so cheap. Can y'all see what I'm doing? Let me try to get this to where you can see. So I'm just going into the hole and just brushing on the paint because you don't want it white. People would be able to see it and it just kind of stands out when it's white. So it does look better painted. And I'm going into both of my colors. I have them mixed on my plate. Can y'all see that mess? But I just have them, the two colors mixed. So that way it's not too green it's just the right kind of shade in there yeah you have to upsize thank you Karen this one fits good and I like it so um, you know it may be kind of hit or miss but t-shirts are definitely small and the dresses I don't know I don't know about that you know you get what you pay for and I've wasted a lot of money on cheap clothes that don't fit. So sometimes you just kind of have to go for less but better quality. And that's why I like these trees because I do know the quality on these trees. I've been doing them for years. And um, so, you know, the ones you're ordering other places, I don't know. I, I, don't, I can't speak for them. You can ask them where they get them, but they're gonna probably tell you a wholesaler also. So hopefully they'll be good. Um, let's see oh who said that April thank you yeah yeah Linda it's not good quality this one is pretty good I really do like this one um, but you know like I said, it's kind of hit or miss. 
doing these kind of projects are so fun. I mean, to me, this is fun and I, you can do this obviously sitting at the table and watch a movie while you're doing it or, um, you know, wherever in your art room and just set some, set a movie to go and then you'll have, you'll have fun. And if you order now, that I, I was kind of like, oh, it seems so early. It's so hot in July, but, but it really is a good time to order because you have plenty of time to get it done. The closer it gets to the holidays, we get so busy. So November, you know how November is. It's like the whole month is busy and you're kind of getting ready for Thanksgiving and you're shopping for Christmas and all the things, baking more. So you definitely want to do it by October, in my opinion, um, to not have to stress and rush. So why not? That's what I said. So we'll do something every Friday that's Christmas in July. I don't know. I might do a craft next or an art. I kind of want to do some glass art, some Christmas glass art. Um, does anybody enjoy doing the glass art or do you enjoy watching it done? Or would you guys rather do a craft or y'all let me know or painting Darlene I am gonna check prices so right now the only one that I have listed is this 13 inch because every time I've sold them in the past this one sells like hot cakes and very few people buy the small and very few people buy the large. Everybody seems to want the 13 inch. So this one is 55. And if you happen to be in the VIP membership group, my monthly membership, then yours is $5 off that. And you would use the code that is inside the group. Um, but 55 is the price. And I believe shipping is $10.95, $10 for shipping, um, which, you know, depending on where you live, that may not cover it. Shipping can, I've shipped trees, like I said, for years, and sometimes, like, shipping to New York before has cost me, like, $17. So, I just set it at one price to make it easy on everybody, and, you know, um, it won't be less than 10 but some of that, I won't make any profit if it's a lot. So, you know, it just... That's just how I do it for, for ease and to keep the price fair. I can't stand overcharging. I can't stand, you know, maybe one day, but <laughs> I mean, I do have a lot to learn about business and all that because sometimes I see people's prices and plus the shipping and I'm like, oh my gosh, I can't afford that. So I try to keep everything, you know, as low as I possibly can for you guys. And I always assume if somebody's got it really, really cheap, they must have some source or were able to buy it from somebody who uh, maybe sold their business or something. I don't know. Sorry about the, I finally cooled off. I've got two fans blowing on me. <laughs> if you, <laughs> for anybody that watches the replay, they will see me coming in red faced. That was something else oh Lisa what do you use like triple thick or something else resin can be very expensive I do like to do the six inch size because you get this gorgeous piece of art but it's not expensive the resin you're not using a lot of resin so that one bottle will last you a long time um, but yes, the larger pieces can be really pricey to do. Coming in hot. <laughs> you know that TikTok song? <sighs> Literally and physically. <laughs> oh. Bring a fan, April, when y'all come up. <laughs> oh, Patty, I agree. I let him take care of my business 100%. We have not gone without one meal, 
and you know if he wants me to make money he'll show me ways and but it will not be by ripping anybody off I'll tell you that I can't do it it there'll be other ways but I just am grateful to be doing this grateful to have met so many great people and I think it's providing um, a need you know to get together with other people so many of us are not as social after COVID. Are you guys, are y'all back to just the way everything was? Or are you just a little bit less social now? It could be just me that, you know, I'm still just not quite back to going out all the time. More thinking about it, I'm sure it's just me. <laughs> my age and my back issues and all that. You haven't tried Carol? Yeah, it's fun to watch. I enjoy watching. Ca yes, they do. I use Pirate Ship, Catherine. I do. I use Pirate Ship almost exclusively because they have been the cheapest. Yeah, Christy, still a little cautious. It is. It is. We need to get out some, but I, I just think the online community has really served a great purpose, you know, because when we couldn't get out and we were really stuck at home, look what we all discovered, you know. I had never dreamed of going live. Uh, I did this in person. I went and did this type of party or I did paint parties. Yes, Pirate Ship is a shipping service so you you download pirate ship or you go to their their website and you can buy your postage there so like people like me who ship boxes um it's cheaper to go through them rather than to use the post office not a whole lot cheaper but it'll save you 50 cents and when you're shipping 25 boxes you know it all adds up and sometimes more than that at a time yeah oh you know Rhonda I'm hearing so so many people with it again for the second time um, lots of people Austin and April my son and his girlfriend just had it again and you know it's yeah I mean I know some people are just like you know if, if I get it I get it and all that but there's a lot of people that do have to be a lot more careful because of other underlying conditions Y'all can see that I'm just kind of going in here. I need to hurry it up because I'm really, you can see me taking my brush and kind of brushing it on here and there. But this is what I do. If I see a piece I missed or something, I'll just kind of brush it on while I'm doing these little holes. Oh, you lost friends? Oh, because of, yes, I know. I hate that too. It does, Erlene. That's exactly what I find. It's so expensive to ship. Um, yeah, Rhonda. See, so that's why I love what I'm doing online. Um, you know, I think about doing in-person events again. However, it would take away from what I do online, and I don't want to do that. So it's online for me for now. I you know, I hope that, I hope that this is just how it's going to be for me, because uh, I just love it, and you guys are now my friends, I mean, I, I prob probably am naive in thinking that I have online friends, but I feel like I do, <laughs> and it's really, it's fantastic, it really is, okay, so y'all can see, I hope, I'm just going in here to a couple that I missed, and I'll hold this up and show it to you. And I've been pretty careful to get all of them. Um, I usually like to speed through this part if I'm online, but I, I did decide I'll just send this to one of you. In fact, let's do another happy mail. So the next comment after Rhonda Harbin says lots of new friends was Patty Tomlinson. So you get happy mail, Patty. Says, I love my friend. <laughs> so Patty, send me your shipping address. I might have it though because you just bought a tree so never mind I do have it so I will send you some happy mail let me write it down 
Yes, Christy, you are definitely my online friend. Um, I call Christy, okay, I don't know if I can say this on Facebook because you know how they are, they have words that you can't say, but you know the phrase, um, your, your friend is a ride or blank and it's three letters and the first one is D, the second one is I, and the third one is E. So ride or blank, that kind of a friend, that's what Christy is. I mean, you are there for me. You are there every time I'm here back, basically. You help me when I need somebody to time me. You know, you are a true friend. And so absolutely, I hope we get to meet someday. Hope so much. I have big visions. I don't know how, how long it will take me to get where I dream of, but I do really, really want to meet a bunch of y'all. And um, so we'll see. We'll see what God's plan is for me. I try not to think too far ahead and just walk one day at a time, you know, doing what he tells me to do. Okay, let's see here if we got them all. I can definitely go back after this if I need to, but it's a lot easier to get them now while I've got this on my plate. Oh, good, Linda. Nelda, you have, yes, you're one of my friends I consider, I mean, I just, I really do. And you know, these, a lot of these ladies on here today are probably in my VIP group like Christy and Nelda are, and you really get to know people in your membership. And so when you hear us inviting y'all to come join our membership, trust me, or let me just say this, for me, it is not about the money. And I know that Christy and others, Nelda, I know that you guys know, because um, it is about being there for each other and having a community. And we're doing the fun things together, but we need that. And so I'm just, that's kind of what my business is, is creating that space and having a place and, you know, so instead of doing online paint parties, this is what I'm doing. And so that, you know, does allow us to make money as we do what we do. But for me, it's so much more than just, it's not, I mean, if I ever have to, I can go make money but I really enjoy the community of the group. It is Trisha, I, I love it. We have great people in there, we do. And if, if, if I'm not your style and you're, but you're watching this and you're hearing this, maybe you wanna find one that is because, you know, there's tons of groups out there and um, I'm sure they all have that community aspect yeah, exact, Patty. Exactly. Well, listen, it's just going to get worse. You know, you know how you have heard the phrase, uh, I've read the book, I know how the story ends. Well, the Bible tells us how the story's going to end. And so we know it's going to get worse. And we can still complain <laughs> because you'll still hear me say like, oh, this world is going to blank in a handbasket, you know, that old phrase. And, uh, and it is, I mean, it's, it's a bad you know, a lot of bad going on. So all the more important, you know, for me to have a space where it is safe and it is friends and we can support each other and pray for each other when we need it. And now I am just kind of coming in with a smaller brush. This is where you can get out your smaller brush and just kind of hitting the places I want to, to give it either highlight or some low light, just whichever I think it needs I'm kind of brushing in along this tree now it's not gonna matter a whole lot you could do this one solid color if you want to you don't have to you know use multiple colors it just looks a little more realistic if you kind of give it some dimension through the colors oh Mindy I it's I feel that way oh thank you so much I feel that way about y'all and so whenever I hear you say that or somebody says, you know, you're such a blessing, I'm like, me, me, <laughs> y'all are the blessing to me. But thank you for saying that. And, and I, I really 
I don't take it lightly. I do appreciate every one of y'all and, and accepting me the way I am and all of that stuff. Yeah, I think it's pretty to use a couple of different colors and okay I think that's just done and you can really give it variety if you want to that's pretty good for the way I like it okay thank you Amber so are you so are you girl I am gonna put a little bit more of this if, if you get too much green down here then and I might not do this. I'll do this after. Um, I was going to say I'm going I'm to put the gold back down here. But I'll, I'll wait. I don't really have to do it with on camera. We do need grays, right? All of us do. Yeah, Darla, you're right. I mean, yeah, it's it has served a really important need. And I think now so many of us are friends, you know, not just crafting business or whatever that we we don't you know we're not gonna stop we love this we love y'all okay let me lift that up just a little bit okie doke I think that's good I'm gonna take my heat gun and just dry this last coat that I did so we can put on some snow we do we have a lot of people in my VIP group that have back issues don't we Christy um, and so, you know, that's another thing is when you're having a bad day, you pop in there and ask for prayer or message me and ask for prayer. We get it. So we have, um, you know, some are in there who aren't prayers or who aren't spiritual, who uh, don't comment really or don't, you know, that's okay. Be a watcher, you know. I love everybody. You don't have to think the way I do. You don't have to believe the way I do. I love everybody. I really do. We haven't given it away yet. We haven't. Oh, April. I love having you pop on. I haven't resined a tree. You could. I mean, you could. I think you'd have to brush it on. I use triple thick that is uh, the next best thing to resin for me and you know so I don't really yes Nelda that's right and he doesn't only he doesn't only love the people who do his will right he loves all of us and of course he wants all of us to love him and do his will but, aww. April everybody knows you you know like when y'all were gone, they were like, oh, how's their trip going? And yeah, that's right, see. Good to see you, Lisa. I know. You know, it's funny because I notice when people aren't around, but I know how much is out there and how busy we all are. So I never worry about it. Um, but I just, you know, I do notice when people aren't there. Yes, Rhonda, I'll go back and read all these. Um, so that I don't miss what y'all were saying but yes triple thick let me see um, do you know guys that I am out of triple thick this is triple thick it is a super fantastic product um, and again <laughs> I don't care what y'all use you can use whatever you want this is what I use I used to use Mod Podge when I first started it, that is terrible like you know um, Mod Podge I don't know it's okay it's I guess it's okay this gives you the shiniest glossiest sheen and um, so I definitely recommend triple thick and the snow text is what I'm fixing to put on but you can get other brands of this but deco art is just what I use so this is snow text um, which is your next step once you've got it the way you want it I was going to show you though maybe we should choose somebody for the tree so they can tell me if they want any glitter on it I'm going to get out a couple I was going to see if I had green yeah I do okay 
so let's pick the winner for the tree. Let me think. I think I'm going to do a number thing this time. Um, no, I'll just I'll just pick the next comment. So you guys start making comments if you want the tree. It'll be this 11 inch tree. Um, I will. I'll tell you what I'm going to do. It. I'll just kind of give me a second. Oh, don't petty. No, 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 no. I literally never feel bad or feel like, oh, where, you know, I don't, I just, I know there's a lot of us going live all the time. So I don't worry about it at all. I mean, it's easy to, like, you'll stumble along somebody and then you start watching them a while. So no big deal. I don't ever worry about where somebody is. I just, you know, always hope everybody's okay. Trisha, you do? Yeah. So I never want people to think that I care because you can use whatever you want, but I really do love the triple thick. Okay, so the next comment, um, I'm going to just give it another second because I see they're really slow to come in. They're like, it's just kind of like, well, um, okay, I'm going to look away. I'm not looking. And the next comment that comes in, when I look, I'm going to read a comment and then the next one to pop in will be the winner. Does that make sense? It says, Tiffany Hillman, I absolutely, okay, Helen Wolf, you're the winner. So I saw Tina's and then Helen Wolf's popped up. Okay, thank you, Helen, for saying I do beautiful work. Helen, send me a message with your shipping address and I will ship you this tree when I'm done with it, okay? You won, and we'll still do happy mail. We'll still do happy mail. In fact, I'm going to roll back up and pick one of y'all before Helen. So let me find Helen's comment to be sure I go higher. Helen, Helen, Helen. Where is she? It's different on my phone. Hold on, let me go back to Helen on this. I don't even find it now. I'll just stop on somebody. There it was. I saw it. Okay. Stop on Trisha McDonald. Okay. It says, me please. So, Trisha, I will send you happy mail. And I'm sorry you didn't get the tree. So, Trisha and Helen Wolf. Okay. So, you guys messaged me for some happy mail. Okay. So, Helen. So, since this is going to be your tree, you tell me. Do you want any glitter on it? Um, I... I'll show you this one has a little. So let me show you this one. So this, see, yeah, you can see it in the camera now. That has the green glitter on the tree. Do you like it? Or are you thinking, nah? So let me know, and I'm going to look for your comment. Y'all are the sweetest. See, y'all are the sweetest because you're congratulating other people for winning. I love that. Yes, please. Okay, so Helen gets glitter. And I will repaint your base so that it's good. And Hi, Brenda. Watching the replay. Oh, we're going to see that. I'm, I'm glad. I'm glad. Okay, let me ask you this. Was it jumpy? Because somebody said that, um, isn't that pretty? I haven't even opened this yet. It's new. Somebody said that the camera work is, you know, moves around a lot. So how did you notice that or was it? Y'all are the best. I love this. I'm sorry you lost me. It's very, uh, Facebook is very glitchy lately. Okay. So this is Twinkles. It's my favorite thing for glitter because it's very fine. See, you'll see it once I put it on here. Let me show you on the plate. Can y'all see that? Um, I wish, here, let me just grab a solid. It's going to look better on a solid piece of paper. So once I spread it out a little, you'll see how uh, small the glitter is. You see that? So I like this a lot for things like this. Um, it It's not as like childish you know how glitter can kind of seem kind of like yeah twinkles is really pretty so I'm just gonna brush this on and I'm gonna kind of go down the tree a little bit 
because I really want this to be more subtle than, you know, a big glitter tree. Now, Helen, you might want a lot of glitter, so you can tell me if you want a lot. Otherwise, I'm going to do it just kind of, you know, medium. And I'm just brushing. Always use a soft brush. The soft brushes will leave less, you know, of course, this isn't paint, but when you're painting on your trees, try to grab one with the soft bristles when you're on this. Yes. Twinkles. There you go. Does that work? Love that. I have lots of colors of this. This is the really pretty iridescent, but I've got, oh, and then I've got the holographic looking stuff. I have a lot of these. They're really fun to play with. Yeah, we have lots of those. Oh, however I wish. Okay, well, I'll do it like I would like it for me. That's what I usually do. Does anybody have any questions I haven't answered? Just ask me right now, and I'm going to try to really be watching. Um, Y'all have been amazing to stick with me, because I know this is a long process, and I know some were like I'm out but that's okay y'all if you wanted to see it you're getting to see the whole thing which I think sometimes is good you need to watch from start to finish kept free it kept the movie kept freezing or do you mean you were freezing it kept freezing tonight April you don't want to know. You'll be sad. Yeah, this, this stuff is gorgeous because, like I said, it, I like this on trees because it's fine. It's not, you know, that big, giant glitter like some. This one is not the one I'm selling. This is 11. This one is the one I'm selling, and it's 13 inches. You can tell by, you know, kind of, it's a good substantial tree. This is my favorite size. Um, let me grab this large one. I forgot to show y'all the large one. Oh goodness y'all. This is the mambo tree. I call this big mama. Can y'all tell how big? This is a big tree. And it is beautiful. I just don't have anywhere to put it. But it is gorgeous really really big this one I think is a last time I checked um, these sold for a hundred so I will check again and see if it's on sale for anybody who might want it um, if it is it'd be around 90 so let me just see what I can do if anybody wants it but the 13 inch yes this 13 inch here this Hold on, let me look. Let me just look. This actually, this is one of the first ones I did. This has got a uh, Mod Podge on it. This is not the triple thick. And I wish I could show you the triple thick. This one is just the clear Mod Podge. And um, so it is nice and glossy. The triple thick is thicker and glossier. So it's somewhere in between this tree and resin it's just really a good product oh hi Barbara glad you found me too <laughs> I love doing ceramics we I, I've done a lot of different things and probably will again this Christmas you know fall and Christmas oh pumpkins I do pumpkins and um, but I need to I need to see they're just so expensive ceramics are expensive and the shipping is very expensive because they're heavy and they have to be packaged well so I didn't know if I was gonna do ceramics this year I really did not it's a lot of work and you're not making any or at least the way I price them I wasn't making any profit really so I think in order to, for them to be affordable you just don't make profit so it's more of a service that I offer, which is okay, but I don't know, it's a lot of work to package and ship and everything. So we'll see, we'll see. 
it just depends on what prices I can get them for and everything the larger studios that can order a whole bunch probably get price breaks and that helps but I don't have that many ordering at a time oh y'all this is really pretty this turned out really pretty with this on here okay let me see if y'all can see this in the camera let me take this light and see if I can shine it on here <laughs> okay yes I have to wait till I can see but you see y'all see the glitter yes 13 inch thank April thank you April yes triple thick is last and I'll tell you why now um, oh it's okay Amber I know this is a long one it's okay it's okay it's okay hi Jackie oh I hope you're feeling good I hope you're feeling better anyway oh you did Helen that's awesome okay Helen I have a question for you um, do you want snow because not everybody likes snow but I usually put snow on the on the branches oh that's so cool yeah Rhonda oh oh did you you didn't send me a picture I would love to see it oh hold on Christy I saw Christy right um oh who said that I don't see the original comment but I'm gonna have to go back and help you listen you can do it any of the things that I teach are not hard and um, I'll tell you what I'm gonna do for the ladies you know for the VIP group I'm going to make a video with the painting that we did last night let me grab it where is it just took it off the wall we did this last night and a couple of people had difficulty with it what I told them I would do is do a slowed down tutorial where I just show you right on the painting and tell you exactly what to do that will be a good one for you to try uh, I think it was Lila that said that but I'm not positive I'll when I get done here I'll go look snow did 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 uh, Helen yes okay so yeah I use the snow text and I love it you can finger works great you can use an old brush if you want to you can use a popsicle stick whatever you want to use this is an older brush I'll use um, and if you haven't used it see the texture it's just got great texture and I know people make their own they use sand white paint and I believe glue uh, there's a recipe on Pinterest but I just wait till this is on sale and buy it because it's just the perfect consistency for me so why you know I just do that oh Darla you could we laughed about that last night in the paint party because Christy was saying the same thing like I'm always like how does she do that and she's tried to paint upside down and I don't know how I do it I just do I, I started because I wanted everybody to be able to see better and maybe God just helps me because <laughs> it is weird and it's weird angles that I paint at but it works and then y'all can see good and I have not had to invest in more money into equipment you know because I was like I could buy another camera or something but man I just can't so anyway it's it's worked so I typically just put this on the tips of the branches like so and it will dry you know just like it is so it gives you the texture and the look of snow and you can put as much or as little as you want and then here's the thing so for me I don't want this to yellow I don't know what it's gonna do in 30 years if I put sealer on top of the snow right um, when I've heard people say no you can you can seal it you know do that um, since I haven't done it and I don't have the company telling me I can do that I don't do it I just prefer not to so what I do is I get the triple thick 
and I take a very soft brush so you know I'm not going to use my Zen brush but if y'all have one of these you know how soft the bristles are so I find a soft brush you know it can it doesn't have to be it can be uh, you know any brush that has soft bristles and I brush my triple thick on it avoiding the snow so that way the whole tree is sealed and I just avoid the snow Oh, Debbie, you can, you can. Y'all stick with me. I'll show you how. I'll show you because we need to, you know what we need to do, April, if you're still on, we need to go live when you're here because I don't know if you've ever painted a flower, have you? And I will teach April, if she'll let me, to paint a flower live and y'all will see. And y'all paint with me. What do y'all think? My, I can't get my kids to go live. They they don't want any part of being on TV or TV, being on, you know, having their face out there. They don't know. But I bet April would do it. Let's see. Ah, yay! I was like, she's probably going, no, I'm not doing that. <laughs> yay! See? I got one that'll do it. But doesn't this tree just start taking on life when you get the snow on it? And you can just picture, you know, Christmas time and having this tree out on your little table and putting the lights on it. If you've got grandkids, man, these are the best things. Because I can remember, you know, always looking forward to getting out this tree and putting the little pegs in. I would always wanted to be the one that put the little light things in and and now here I'm painting them hoping for a grandchild someday and so you know kids would love to have one of these so anybody that's watching let me know if you want a smaller tree or a larger tree but otherwise the ones that I'm offering right now are uh, the 13 inch that are $55 and if you're in the VIP group they're 50 and if you've wondered about the VIP group or something you don't know quite what all is involved um, please either ask me or just go to my website and you can read about it you can even join us so there's a you know you can either get on uh, the wait list for the next open time or if you want in now I don't think I'm trying to think I don't think I have changed it yet <laughs> I keep saying I'm going to but I keep forgetting to do it so I think that you can still click the button and join it. Yeah, you can because somebody just did. So um, I just haven't had time to go on there and fix it. Larger possible Sue, yes. I love the large one, love it. But you can see I haven't even painted it yet because what am I gonna do with it? So yeah, I love it. It's just really big. Yeah, light bright. Yeah, it is this. You know, we used to use the light bright. Now, now they have this. Let me take one out so you can see it better. You know, the they're like cute little bulbs now. Uh, but we we with my grandmother, that is exactly what we used. Was we used the light brights. So let's do another happy mail. Um, because I really really wanted to do a bunch of those and. I got to talking. I hope people didn't leave going, well, she's not doing happy mail. But you guys that stuck it out, you'll you'll get to benefit. So um, when I look up, whatever comment is there is already there, but I'm going to grab the next comment. That's just how I'm doing it. I saw somebody else do that, and that's what I'm going to do. And, um, and we'll do that. Okay, I love that tree, Deb Brown, said Brenda. Thank you. And Darla, you are the next one. Thought of you today. Saw a peachy tank. Oh, how funny. <gasps> you did? That's hilarious. Because I was... Okay, let me write your name down before I forget. Um, so, we got to talking about that one night. And I was like, what is that? Peachy? Do y'all know what that is? You did a white tree nailed up? Did you get one for me? I know you've bought something ceramic for me. Oh, Rula, thank you guys for, thank you for sticking it out. I'll probably pick some more of you. I'll just surprise you because this has been a long tutorial and you guys that have stuck it out, 
that's amazing to me because it's hard to sit and watch somebody that long so I'll I'll surprise some of you um do y'all know what the <gasps> Debbie I'm so happy that's awesome you know I I, it shouldn't be open right now, but I'm glad that it's open because I want anybody who wants in there to come on in. We love it. We have fun. I have a guest, at least one, come in every month to teach so that you're not just getting me, but you're getting some of my friends that have businesses and uh, teach things that I don't maybe or just differently. So this month for July, we have Kathy Monaco with Royal Funky Junk. And we have Karen Harper with Crowning Touch Design. Wait, Crowning. Oh, I just lost it. Crowning Touch Designs. Somebody correct me if I'm wrong because now my brain's like, is that it? Um, so we've got two this month for July. And it's going to be a great month. So we do one paint party a month. I teach every week inside the group and we do challenges we are just now about to do for july a new challenge where not challenge but just like a swap so anyone who wants to can um, sign up to exchange and we've done ornaments we've done cards and this one is going to be a cute little mixed media piece um, and i taught the lesson already in the group and i'll probably teach one more and do it a different way and then you make one and send to somebody and then you get one and they're really cute so we just do a lot of fun things oh sue thank you it's so funny because i don't like it i can't when i go back and look at comments and stuff i'll turn the video on but then i mute myself because i can't stand to hear my voice thank you for saying that you just finished yours christy good Linda, I do sell them painted. I usually do every Christmas because um, people will message me and say, I, I need one, but I don't, I don't think I can do it, you know, whatever. So, yes, I'm, I love painting them. I really, really do. So, message me if you want one, and I'll tell you the price. I don't know. I, I'm going to have to look what I, what I charged last year. I don't even remember. Because um, they're, you know, you can see they're time-consuming, but... You know if you're just not into it you and or you don't you know sometimes people are like well my daughter's like this she'd much rather pay somebody to do it pay the extra and have them do it she's not going to take the time and then go buy the items and then she's going to have a big thing of this and she doesn't want it you know so some people just would prefer somebody else to do it and that's totally fine I just for the first time put my first piece of art on my website y'all so um, I have had a couple of people ask to buy it and I was like oh wow that's the first I've never had anybody ask so um, I went ahead and just listed the one item and if anybody wants it I will paint them one you know so it'll be I'll paint it when you order it but it will be the one I have on my website but it was if you guys were at the Alzheimer's event, it was the angel that I auctioned off. And um, some people wanted it. I guess one of them was for somebody. And the other was just for herself, I guess. But I'm always happy to do custom orders. You know, we love that. If you love something we make and you want one, we love that. I do. Okay, how are y'all liking this? Oh, thanks, Sue. <laughs> Steak. <laughs> Steak. Oh, Mindy, I totally get it. And I do a lot online. I mean, you see me a lot. I, I do. No, I so understand. I mean, there's one that I want in really bad, but I can't, I can't pay that. So, yeah, it's okay. No worries. That's why, you know, we all still try to do things on our lives and everything and, um, there's a, you know, there's a line. You, you want to save a lot of things just specifically for your group that is able to do that. But I totally get it. So I try to do as much as I possibly can here just on my page. And, yeah. 
No worries. And you know, it's also uh, something you can get as a gift. Like if you have, especially, I always recommend anyone who needs a community. So if, you know, if I had known about this, like I, it wasn't on the radar years ago, but when my mom was still in her prime, you know, maybe she would have enjoyed a group. But so people that live alone that don't get a lot of conversation, groups are great for them. So it'd be a great gift too for somebody. Um, so just remember that for people that are hard to buy for or maybe have lost a loved one and and they just need some support. Groups are great for that. You can always, they can always try it a month and if they don't like it, you know. I'm just kind of talking just because I'm working, but Sherry, here's the thing. I try not to mix the two. So I will go in and brush on my triple thick around the snow. Um, that's how I do it. And that's how I teach it because I don't want there to be any kind of reaction at any time. You know, I just want it to look like this forever. So honestly, I don't know if it would cause any kind of reaction, but you know, like, you know how you're like, well, in 30 years, would it, I don't know. So I'm just gonna do it this way because I know it works. But you know, if you find out different, you let me know. And then you, you see that I'm putting a little more down on the larger branches down here. We're almost done, guys. Y'all have been so patient. I know we lost a bunch, but that's okay because I always figure, you know, the ones that really want to see the whole process, they are going to stay or they'll come back for the replay. And I, I did, okay, so if you're not on my text alert, you don't know this, but I did send a text alert and I will pick uh, I make sure to pick somebody from that text alert to also win Happy Meal. So um, if you are interested in that, then you can just text art. Well, the at sign, let me type it in. Let me type it in because I don't want to mess that up. At art grace tx to Eight one zero one zero. I could have asked one of y'all to do it. Um, that's what you would text. Yes, Nelda, that was you. Um, that's what you would text, and you will be on my text alert list. So that means before my live, I send out a text saying, "Hey, I'm about to go live. Come on, you know." And um, so anyway, I always make sure to give one person some Happy Meal that showed up from that. So I used to always say, uh, tell me if you got my text, but then I would have so many people going, I got your text, I got your text, you know, that it was like over and over and over and over. So I just know who's on the text list. I don't have, you know, that great of a number that I can't figure it out. And if I saw somebody, I'll send them something. I just, I like doing that. And sometimes I get behind, so don't don't worry if it takes me two weeks to get to you. That's not unusual. But okay, how's that? Oh, y'all, isn't it cute with the snow? I love the snow. It adds so much. Did I miss any? And the glitter. Okay, I think it looks good. Just clean off your brush when you use Snowtex. Like I'll take this into the kitchen and wash with really good warm soapy water. I use just a tiny little bit of Dawn dishwashing liquid and some warm water. Thank you guys. Oh good, Deborah. Oh, thanks, Laura. Did you get a text today, Linda? Oh yes, Lisa. Wasn't the camper that camper has been my favorite thing I've painted. 
by far when it comes to ceramics because of the buffalo check. I love that camper. Oh, is that right, Nilda? Teresa, I try to. Uh, yeah, on, on something like this where I kind of made an event out of it, like, hey, it's a big deal because I know there's so many people who want to see that whole process. And I need to start doing some more, um, some more tutorials that I can video and upload uh, because that is a really great way to learn is to just follow a tutorial. Okay, so here's the thing, y'all. I, uh, I placed an order to Michael's to get my triple thick and I was thinking that Michael's left this out of my order, but it was my fault. I actually didn't add it. So I looked at it and I remember choosing the larger size but when we got home, it wasn't in the sack. And when I looked at my order, it wasn't there. So it's my fault. But this, it, it's had the lid off and it's not good. But all you do, it comes, you know, it comes like this in, in the tub. Or you can get a smaller thing. And let me find you something similar. This is very similar. So it can come in this size, like a two ounce size. And it will say triple thick. It'll look just like this, but smaller and it's liquid but it's thick and you just take a soft brush and brush it on and that's it you're just brushing it on avoiding the the you know avoiding the snow just go all around and you know i put it on pretty thick in fact when i buy some in fact i tell you what i'll do i'll go get some because i needed i've got to have it and um and i will video me brushing it on so that you don't have any questions and you're not wondering um we are gonna we i don't typically put any snow up here tell me what y'all think does it need snow up there it probably does that's an interesting thing now that you say because look i didn't put snow on this one but should i um we're gonna plug this baby in and put some lights but um so I'll do that so that y'all can see that process because sometimes you wonder, you know, well, let me see how thick she put it. And um, so I should put snow on there, right? That's so funny. Yes, if you want to add some uh, Duraclear to it, yes, that's exactly right. She's right. Yeah. Snow on top. Okay. That's so funny. I didn't do it on this one. I should just do it on here and see what happens because this is my own tree uh yes they come with the so this is the tree that i'm selling right now it's 13 inches and it's got the separate base and this let me just show you i'll show you exactly how this works so you get the base and you get the tree and then this comes all coiled up you know a light kit it plugs in and this little light kit has the two prongs okay see those so you just squeeze the prongs together and take your base and pop it in here. Now, watch this. You just kind of push this. I don't know if y'all heard that, but it kind of click. It just kind of clicks into play. Oh, I didn't even push this one down. So push that to where it clicks. You heard that surely. And that now that's set. And then the cord goes right through here. And then set your tree on top and then you just put on all of your things so it comes with a star I've seen on Amazon they have other stars you can buy I guess a little fancier but I don't know. this is the only star that my grandmother used so I kind of like it I'm very nostalgic I like all of the old things and I like it to look like like it used to so I just use that one you can order lights uh, you know all red all pink all green all white clear you know anything you can think of they have every color under the Sun I have painted this tree uh, in pink for breast cancer awareness and I believe I've got YouTube videos of all the other ones I've done it in Halloween so it was uh, I've done two Halloween because one of them I gave away so the next year I did another one um, black 
I don't, I don't, I've never glued my lights in, but a lot of people do, and you can. But I'll tell you why I don't, because as a child, I loved this part. So I'm not kidding, as a 50 something year old lady, I still enjoy sitting here putting these lights in. So I don't. But yeah, people do glue them in. I've seen people say they use hot glue, um, permanent glue, you know, Allen's clear tacky glue would work. I just don't because I enjoy this. And if I have grandkids someday, then they will enjoy putting these in. And so, yeah, that's, that's me. And as you can see, I'm not worried about placement here. I'm just getting them in there. April, I wish you were here now if you're still on because you could turn my lights off for me. Let's see. Maybe we need to go live when April's here more often. I'm trying to get them to move over by us. We'll see. Okay. Y'all ready? Now, I need to turn off some lights so y'all can see. <laughs> yes, you are. I've seen you answer questions and I always laugh because you know exactly what products I use and all that. Okay. Well, gee, there's so many lights. This is how it is. There's so many lights. I know it's still not quite dark, but that's as good as it'll get. Can't tell what I'm doing. Oh, no. There. <laughs> Isn't it the cutest thing? Oh my gosh, I love these trees. Can y'all see okay? I know it's still a little light because I, I can't get to all of them. Yes, isn't it pretty, Tina? I know I love, I love doing these. I think you're right about the snow. It's so funny, I never thought about it. But I am gonna add some snow to this. I'm gonna get some triple thick and brush that on um, Helen's tree. And, oh, let's pick another Happy Meal. Next word, okay, I see Lisa says pretty. The next one that pops up, we'll get Happy Meal. Lisa Key says beautiful. Now you guys have to send me your address. Don't forget to, to message me your address and give me up to two weeks. I hope that I can do it quickly, but I'm just saying, I have so much going on all the time that I, I get behind. Even the star tips. Oh, that's a good idea, Susan. That is a great idea to put some up here on these. I like that idea. Oh, very fun. Okay, guys, that's it. Thank y'all so much. I can't believe we have almost 50 of you that stayed the whole time. That is amazing. If you are interested in a tree from me, then just go up to, yeah, okay, I'll do that, Christy. Um, go up to the description in this video and you can click on the link. It'll take you to see the page. If you are in the VIP group, though, be sure you go into the group and use the link that's in that group, okay? Um, thank you, Helen. Yes. Okay, you did. Thank you. Well, congratulations. I'll be sure your tree's perfect. And now I have pressure knowing that you used to do them. Oh, I love that, Linda. Yeah. The, if anybody's interested in a really small or a really large one, then let me know and I'll check prices. Okay. No promises. I'm just going to check prices and see. You guys are amazing. I hope you have a wonderful 4th of July and safe, safe, safe. So maybe, maybe even just stay indoors. <laughs> I don't like to drive. I don't like all that, but you guys have a great weekend, and I will see you soon. In fact, I might go live again tomorrow. We'll just see. And um, I'd love to, to do this triple thick for you, so we might do that. Thank you, guys. Y'all have a great night, and thanks for being here. Bye. Thank you, guys.